Hey everybody, yep, I'm vlogging from bed. Um, <clears throat> trying to avoid a cold here, but Zenny 62 Media Entertainment Vlogger Extraordinaire Jessica Dwyer just posted a really fantastic live vlog retort to the uh, rather questionable publication that Jezebel has become in posting a fake news article about legendary Superman actor Henry Cobble and I made this vlog because when I listened to Jessica talk about how terrible and reprehensible their claims were saying that Henry was calling him a gamer bro, right? And then reaching for the, well, he wasn't kind to women on the set trope. Reminded me of all the things that I started to hate about Jessica that add up to virtue signaling. That is, in the quest to be what it considers a feminist blog to be. It has to attack white guys ignore black guys, except, of course, the black guy happens to do something wrong, which is classic. And in general, insult anyone and everybody that doesn't fit its narrow view of what a woman is and should be. And I'm not saying that I, as a guy, have that classic all-encompassing definition that everybody should follow. No, that's not what this is about. This is about the fact that Jezebel is desperately grasping at straws to achieve relevancy in the wake of its disastrous collapse where Geo Media let go of a bunch of people and then in the process sacked its black editor and replaced it with a white one and gave the black editor a woman a hard way to go from what I've read. I don't know the situation intimately, to be honest, but hey, look, uh, someone felt it was important enough to get out there that she was being treated like crap. So all this happened in 2021. Okay, so here we are, 2022, and Laura Goldman is in places, it's the editor, Views in general have been declining for that kind of media versus video. And so clickbait, here we come. Oh, who do we pick on? Well, let's see. Uh, Henry Cavill just lost his job as Superman because, well, the new minders of the brand, DC Entertainment, decided they wanted to go in a different direction for it reasons best known to them, which I happen to think personally is absolutely insane. I mean, look, James Gunn did a great job with Guardians of the Galaxy. No question about it. But let's look at his other material. Brightburn, nothing. And you would say, what's that? And I would say, exactly. Okay? So, <laughs> no. But I digress. Back to Jezebel and Henry Cobble. Leave Henry Cobble alone. As far as I'm concerned, Henry ought to be the next James Bond anyway. Subscribe to Zenny62 and bookmark OaklandNewsNowBlog.com.